Tab here with the Red Carpet Rundown on Booth TV. Yep, we are here at NBC for the Press Comedy Junket, Eva Longoria's new show, Telenovela, and America Ferrara's new show, Superstore. They're on their way, so let's go check it out. Come on. The past roles that you've done, you're the villain. You don't look like a villain. That's what I say. Thank you. You should be my man. Nice. Um, I know. Uh, people keep casting me as the villain. What's that about? I'm the nicest guy there is. I mean, you don't want to mess with me, but... I would not want to mess with you. <laughs> but I'm nice. I'm actually not. And it's funny because I've always complained to Eva. I go, baby, why do I keep cast as a, as a villain? I got a movie playing the villain. I got a movie playing the villain. Why can't I be Cameron Diaz's best friend or Rachel McAdams' boyfriend? I can do The Notebook. The Ryan Gosling's <laughs> of our generation. <laughs> uh, I'm a nice guy. So anyway, Eva based this role on me and gave me the shot to play the villain again. I love it. But also... I get to play the good guy. So it's a little bit of dichotomy that I'm having a good time with. Do you have a lot of kissing scenes? Because I know you're on a Spanish soap, soap opera. I do have, we do it. I got, I got, well, as the villain, I don't. As the villain, because the villain doesn't get any, it doesn't get laid, I guess. I don't know why. See, that's why, that's why he's always angry. Um, no, but I, in the behind the scenes, I end up hooking up with one of these, which is amazing because then it becomes the whole thing of how you're not supposed to shit where you eat. Well, basically, that's what happens, and then it becomes this a little bit of a controversy, or um, it makes it a, not the best work environment to, to work in. How do you feel about, you know, the other cast members? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm going to be honest. These guys are, and again, I, you know, and I've been in shows before. There's a camaraderie that happens, especially when you go and shoot somewhere else. You know, you get to hang out all the time because let's say we go to Chicago, we go somewhere else that we don't know. We, you tend to hang out with the same people. Here, we live here, and we're hanging out with us, with each other all the time. Uh, and Eva has created that from day one. She has, see? We're just talking bad about We're you. talking bad about you. We're talking smack about you. <laughs> Actually, you know, what he gave us? you know what he gave us for uh, as a gift? These little bench, what you, what's the name of the thing that you gave us? Is it when you go to the bathroom? And you sit on the toilet? Yes, the squatty potty? Yes! You see? Everyone needs it. I didn't know that. I had never seen that. Wow, what a nice Friendsgiving. She gave every single one of us one of those. But she was asking me how, how much we got along, and I told, I told her, you know what? We, it's not bullshit. We all, oh, shit. <laughs> do whatever you want. Okay, no, we actually We're do. We're fucking friends. <laughs> <laughs> we, do love, we do like each other. We hang out all the time. And, we, we don't, and I was telling her, we don't have to. We live here. We have other friends. And we do, and even when we're not shooting, we'll come to set and hang out. We, we and it started with Eva. She, she made an amazing environment. Game nights are her house. Yeah. I mean, but what these guys are intelligent because they're finding uses for the squatty potty that I never even thought of. Um, they're using it as like a step stool, as an assist thing. I mean, these guys are smart. They're not just pretty faces. They know what they're doing. Hi, my name is Amaury Nolasco, and check us out at bbooth.com.